up everybody my name is potato and this is another server Saturday we're gonna be kicking it off by visiting mr. Moje's tempest tempest F fuck it tower I, get, I think it's fuck it it could be fugit but I think it's fuck it tempest fuck it t clock tower and uh, this is right near our spawn uh, well it's actually right near Nubtown uh, in reality uh, and there's a sweet dirt house right here oh Okay, well, we're gonna take a break from Mr. M oh no, this is way too deep. Never mind, we're going back to Moje's place. Uh, but there's a sweet, sweet dirt house right here with a tool bench and and it's lakeside, so it's expensive, and everybody wants a lakeside uh, house, right? So fucking get buy this, three thousand three billion dollars, three thousand billion dollars. Anyways, Tempest fucking tower. Let's check this thing out. First floor seems pretty empty. There's no basement here, all right? So we don't have to go that way. So the only way to go is up. And uh, of course, the railing system in Minecraft is not the best because you can't really do spiral rails without it getting real messy real quick. And uh, looks like he has some balconies here. All right, let's go a little bit higher up. Let's go check out the top floor. All the way to the top floor. Okay. Oh, oh, okay. You're missing missing some blocks here. Uh, or maybe this is just part of the, the test to make sure that you're worthy enough to go... Oh, shit. To the top. Yeah. I feel like someone may have world edited something out. or so Oh, shit. No, this, this seems to be part of it. Okay, hold on. I got this. This is, uh, this is a trial run, isn't it? This is to... This is like wax on, wax off, but for Minecraft style. Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay, see, I failed. I, I probably would have died there. Okay, well, we gotta go back up then. Up and up and up and up. And jump it. Yeah. And jump it. Yeah. Nailed it. Pretty awesome. I don't know if you guys know that, but pretty awesome. Okay. Let's just go around this way. Okay, all right. That was that was probably the wrong way. Let's just let's take the easy route then. So we gotta we gotta climb up on this glass thing. Bam. There we go. I don't know. Oh, God damn it! You, got, you put a block there. Well, shit. This isn't no ordinary tower. All right. So climb back up. 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 Alright, so there's this block right here that's in our way. And, uh, so we gotta make this as short as possible. There we go. Now I keep looking up to see if there's anything I'm gonna be hitting. There we go. Nothing here. No, we got some blocks over there, though. Going up. There we go. Nice. It's a pretty cool looking view of Candle's place over there. I wonder how much, uh, much work he's getting done on that. I know he's a uh, pretty busy guy. Ah, oh, shit! <laughs> All right, I'm just gonna I'm gonna go back to this floor. Um, so PAX East is going on right now, and uh, I really wish I had the the money to go there because Rooster Teeth has a um, a convention exclusive T-shirt right right now over there. And, uh, the panel, Gus only showed a little bit of it, but he was wearing so many things around his neck that it made it really hard to see. Okay. I gotta remember about that jump. So, um, if anybody is at PAX East and wants to be super cool, and, um, maybe tweet me a picture of that, uh, of the shirt, that'd be really awesome. Oh, damn, I can't. I figured I was clever by going around, but um, I really want to know what that shirt is because if so, I may PayPal someone some money and be like, hey, give me that shirt. I don't care if you have to wait in line for three hours. Actually, I prefer someone who who is going to stand in line anyways for the Rooster Teeth people. You know, that way they can get it. Uh, get something else on their own too, but I don't know. I, I want to know what the shirt is and if it's awesome, then I definitely want one. Anyways, this is the top of the tower, the Tempest Clock Tower. There's no clock in here. It was all, it's all, uh, all a lie. I don't know why we couldn't see that from the outside, since you know it's a glass dome and all. But it was a pretty fun little, 
walkway up here. I mean, it was kind of shitty, and I probably would have died if I didn't have God Mode on, but... Good job, Mr. Moje. Let's, uh, let's move on to the next build. Alright, here we are at Mr. Wong's, uh, manor. I think it's just called Wong's Manor. Um, with the world's longest driveway. And, uh, it's an all, all brick building. Well, I, yeah, that's brick, right? No, that's cobblestone. That's my cobblestone. I'm, get, I'm getting confused, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, and he has two big old garage doors here. And, uh... Yeah, no, just regular old garages here. It's pretty awesome. It looks like there is a doorway that goes inside, and there's an Enderman over there checking out your shelves or something. Uh, I'm just kind of going to go do this however which way I wander to because I feel like there's the layout of this is just going to confuse me. you got a pool in the back here, and that's pretty cool. And uh, a dock over there for what seems to be the river that connects to uh, the one right next to Spawn. Over here is a bathroom. Pretty awesome. I like the the white wool as tile. Makes sense. Got some shelves there. Got storage over here. Uh, you got a you got a storage full of creepers. I don't know if if that's what you're trying to do, but you got a storage full of creepers. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, well, that didn't work out well for him. I'll just put torch to pack there for you. And uh, you got more creepers in your living room and another Enderman. You gonna come with me? Yeah, he's gonna come with me. Alright, so he's gonna make weird fart noises behind me uh, as we go into the sink. Yeah, you didn't like the sink, do you? <laughs> Anyways, I like the, the giant table here. The, uh, I guess these are called islands, right? Uh, hello, how are you? My name is Potato. Get off me. There we go. Alright. Uh, dining room table, I assume, right there. It looks like this go. There's no doorway here, so you got a very breezy house, I assume. This is uh, the other garage. Doesn't look as finished as the other one. Let's check out the living room. I do like how open it is, though. I, d I do like that. Um, it feels like it's a very California thing. Maybe Florida too, because it's it's sunny there too. But. Um, I've been to a lot of the, the fancier homes um, over here in California where they're, they're, they're very open like this where the living room and the kitchen and everything like that, there's, there's basically no walls and uh, it's always kind of cool but then you got to think that you know your, your sound system here has to be pretty pumping you know to be able to, to push all the, the sounds and stuff to the other rooms and it still sound good or maybe if you're rich enough to have a house this big, you probably got those embedded speakers in the ceilings just everywhere and shit. I don't know. I want a fancy house, but there's no way that I could ever afford one. Unless I start pulling in Yogcast money, where, you know, every video I'm pulling in, well, just ton tons of money, just millions of money. And they're making a game now or something? They started a Kickstarter for some game? I don't know. It didn't look that great, the, the, the little video, but... Whatever. It's still in super beta test, so I'm sure if I looked at Minecraft, like the, the beginnings of... Well, actually, I did look at Minecraft back in the beginning days, and I thought it was awesome. I didn't really care, so I don't know. And then they said something rude about Notch, didn't they, at the end of the video? I don't know. I didn't watch the whole thing. I just heard about it. Anyways, enough speculation and defam and whatever. What is this? What, what is going on over here? This is like, I don't, is this a seat where you sit here and you watch someone, uh, I don't even, I can't even make up anything weird to say about this. I don't even know, do you, do you sit up here too and just watch that person sitting? Like a double decker seat or something? I don't know. Bleachers? Ah, yeah, it's probably bleachers. I think this is supposed to be the bathroom. Got two closets over here at the end, and he uses this, this the wool as tile in the other room. Um, you submitted this build, Wong, but it doesn't look that finished, bro. It's not very uh, furnished inside. Maybe you thought that I wouldn't get around to it until you uh, you got a little bit more work done. But there's actually not a whole lot of server Saturday entries right now, people. So if you are a part of the server, make sure to submit your builds on our forums. That way, I know who to go check out. How do I get to the second floor? I'm just going to use uh, 
that right there? Oh, it's over here in the corner. Where was it? I want to see. Oh, well, it was right, it was right there. How, I guess it just blended in with the wall or something. Um, I was, yeah, because I just I went all the way around the outside corner there. So let's go check out the basement. See if there's anything extra down here. Looks like there's some farms. Alright. And, uh, got some chests and stuff there. And a tree farm down here. Alright. The essentials, I like it. Don't overproduce and you'll be good to go. Oh no, our server's restarting. But I haven't checked out the first floor. Or the second floor. There's a balcony. And then over here is, is a bedroom. Let's run to the bedroom. Oh, come on! 30 seconds! No! <laughs> Yeah, the other bedroom. This is what the bedroom looks like. And... Uh, no, 10 seconds. Run! I can finish this house! There's another balcony. It's pretty cool. Anyways, we gotta go up this ladder. This is, this is the attic. Look, look at the little attic. There we go. Alright, let's go to the next next build. Alright, so this next build is again from Wong that uh, apparently is just called the Kalfa Prison. And um, the warp that he he gave me on the uh, the submission for this actually just drops you right in the center of the prison, even though there is an outside bit to it. So I'm just going to assume that he wants people to start from this point and not actually go from the outside in. I guess it's a prison, so maybe it's just all all centralized and just like nope. You, you, once you're in, that that's it. You're done. And um, so, anyways. We're, we're inside here, we got a staircase here, and there's a bunch of stuff here on the first... I'm assuming this is the first floor. Um, let me check behind here. Yeah, there's no, no more stairways going down, so... I assume this is probably the bottom floor, and we work our way up. Over here is cell block A, which has a bunch of TNT uh, in the bottom parts. And I'm, I'm not quite sure what your reasoning is behind there, Wong. I mean, I, are you planning a breakout, or is... I, I don't know. Or you have them wired to, if they misbehave, you can just, just kill them all? I, it just feels like bad prison ethics, you know? But who am I to say? I'm, I'm not a warden or anything. And, uh, got another door right here, but I feel like I'm skipping floor, so let's go back down. Go back through here, close that up for you. Cell block A. Okay. You got two signs here that probably take you to, yep, sheep hole and storage. It's a weird warp. Uh, rec that recreation? Yeah, sure is. Recreation. And, um, oh, recreation. That's, that's what it is. Recreation. Uh, maybe, maybe it's just my tired brain that just feels like that's spelt wrong, or maybe it's my tired brain that, that's spelt right and it didn't say it right. Um... That's cool. I like the iron bars. Uh, I wish Minecraft didn't make it look so hectic, you know? Or maybe it's just a... Mm, I don't know. It's probably the texture pack's fault, too. Because um, you can't really do iron bars all that great. Uh, the walls look fantastic, but, you know, putting a roof over it is uh, is difficult. So that's the, the yard, if you will. Over here, the infirmary. Alright, so you got a bunch of beds for dead people. Pretty cool. Uh, I don't know where these doors lead, but I feel like I'm not supposed to enter them since there's no lever here. Uh, upon issue of level 1 protocol, place activator to detonate. If a prisoner is disobedient, beat until unconscious. That's, that's very uh, violent means. Hmm, okay. I guess uh, if things get out of hand, you just you just blow the place up and call it, call it a day. Build another one. And uh, over here is the mess hall. It's going upstairs to that. All right. Got a bunch of uh, tables and stuff over here. I assume this is probably where they grab their food. Come on over here and sit on the second floor. Got to walk upstairs to get your food. That's just how it works. I'm just gonna do a quick butcher and get rid of the people. Ah, yeah, there's 50 mods or mobs within just this little area. I guess I'm assuming these are the showers because what else could they be in 
It's just there's no do no door at all. I mean, I know it's prison and all, but I I don't know. I just feel like there would be something to separate this room from the other the other room, you know? Okay. Maybe this prison is very very open about things. I'm also assuming that these floors are just going to the other cell blocks, so I'm going up. Uh oh, that's it. Okay. These only go to the cell blocks, and uh, it looks like I'm I'm literally just in the prison part, because I see there's a there's a room over here that I can't get to from this side, and I think it's through this door right here. Um, so I'm just gonna skip through that door. Here's the storage area right here. It's very neat, very clean. A little bit further this way, we have um, what seems to be the security. Okay, he's probably still working on that. Because uh, I assume that he wouldn't just leave wire open to where you can't see it. Okay, well there's the, there's the front door right there. Um, I didn't see a way for me to get to that office looking building. You know, oh, warden's office right here. There you go. I skipped right past it just like I did the other place. You can't blame me. I don't know this place. I get lost. It's huge. So here's the warden's office. Got a big ass chair. Probably for a big ass man. I don't know. Warden's not here. He's on vacation with the prisoners. They went to Mexico to hang out on the beaches and shit. I don't, I mean, I don't know what the warden's going to do. Maybe he's a super lenient warden. That's why he doesn't put up a door for for the showers or nothing. He's just like, come on, guys, we're we're all we're all buds here. Oh, oh, you got a lot of. Look at all of them. Come on over here and blow these zombies up. There you go. Uh, so you got a creeper problem in your roof here. I'm just gonna lay down some torches, even though this isn't gonna stop all of them. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Looks like I covered all the buildings. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the service Saturday. I really have to go. I'm sort of late for something. So I will talk to you guys later. And uh, the annotations at the end probably won't work because, like I said, I have to go. And I won't have time to either process either. So I'm going to just upload this publicly immediately. So if it looks like crap, just give it like a half hour or something. Come back and rewatch it. It will be better quality. Anyways, I'll talk to you guys next week. My name is Potato, and this is not my usual outro.